हेलो डियर स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू द ऑनलाइन क्लासेस ऑफ ठान मास्को स्कूल इन दिस विजुअल वी विल रीड अ स्टोरी ऑफ योर बुक रियल इंग्लिश पार्ट फोर एंड चैप्टर नंबर थ्री द नेम ऑफ स्टोरी इज किंग सी बी एंड द टू बर्ड्स किंग सी बी and the two birds in this visual we will read this chapter word by word and within in next visual i will provide the explanation of this chapter to you so i request you all to pay attention on the tip of my pencil and read with me so here we go king cb was famous all over the world and in the heaven heaven for his kindness and good governance he made sure that every being in his kingdom got justice and lived in peace one day cb saw in his garden a wounded pigeon flapping its wings and a desperate effort to fly the king lifted the bird from the ground and wrapped it in his shawl to comfort it the next moment the she saw a fierce falcon landing on the parapet cb at once realized how the pigeon was wounded and why it looked so frightened the falcon spoke in a human voice o king you are known as a kind ruler living for the well-being of your subjects but today you are being cruel to me i show you guarding that pigeon which was my prey why do you snatch my food from me cb replied o kind birds o king of birds this poor pigeon is hurt and tired it came to me my refuse trusting that i would save its life just as you do not want to die of hunger this little bird does not want to be eaten by a predator please tell me in return for this pigeon's life what other food i can offer you the falcon said food is the first choice of every living thing without food we all die if i die my little children that have just hatched with will not survive either please decide if it is right to save one life at the cost of many lives to protect this pigeon you are letting my whole family die is this justice this question this question from the falcon put cb in a dilemma dilemma he thought for a while and said it is one supreme duty to protect someone in danger a king cannot get away from his duties even if everyone else judge i can give you my whole kingdom if you promise not to harm this pigeon this is no solution to my problem persisted the argumentative argumentative falcon i am a carnivorous bird carnivorous bird 
to give me food you will anyway have to kill another creature creature does it then make any difference consider this solution please please give me some flesh for you from your body equal to the weight of this pigeon how well this falcon argues thought cb it has an accurate sense of right and wrong let us move to the next page cb at once ordered a balance to be brought in one in one of its dishes he placed the pigeon he then cut a chunk of flesh from his thigh with a sword and put it in the other dish the pigeon's dish hung low cb now cut a larger chunk of flesh and placed in the dish the pigeon still outweighed outweighed the flesh cb kept carving his body until there was barely any flesh left around his bones the balance was still heavier on the pigeon's side finally cb himself mounted the dish hoping to equal the fate of the bird suddenly divine music filled the air and the heaven showered flowers on cb the falcon and the pigeon disappeared and in their places stood indra the king of gods and the agni the god of fire indra said cb cb agni and i came down from the heaven to test you you have proved that you are far greater than people think you will have a life full of happiness and you will always be remembered by mankind cb's wants disappeared cb's wants disappeared as soon as as soon as these words were spoken these words were spoken he closed his eyes in humble prayer in humble prayer as the gods vanished so dear student this was the story of your book real english part 4 chapter 3 i hope you are able now to pronounce every word of this chapter if you can do so it is very good if you are unable to pronounce it any word you can watch this video again and try to read with me in the in next video i will provide the explanation of this chapter bilingually means in hindi and in english too till that time read this chapter try to read this chapter two or three times and try to understand this story that's it in this video hope you are doing your study well at home so we'll me- we'll meet again in the next video for the time bye have a nice day keep take care of yourself and your family bye